Hello everyone. Welcome to the Vishnu Code Academy. Now we are going to create an amazing game and it is going to be Save the Minion. As you can see from the screen, there's a minion and the game is that I have to save the minion by my motion. It will sense the motion and then whenever it senses any motion, it will be stopped from falling down. So let's see how it works. So this is how it is working. It is falling down and on sensing the motion, it just gets its parachute and goes up back again. So this is how we are able to save the meaning. So let's get started and create this game. So I have made the setup for, for the game. I've just made the back drop as of the clouds. I have just uploaded this backdrop to my computer. And I have got minion and I have even got a costume for it and these two also I have uploaded from my computer uh, first one is a normal one and the second minion is the minion with the parachute and we also need an extension that is our video sensing as you have seen so it's just got started on just clicking on the video sensing from the extension and so for the backdrop first let us set something when the flag is clicked the transparency should be good or else if the transparency is not good then it will be difficult for detecting so on uh, for the backdrop also we have written a small code the flag is clicked that video transparency should be 70 and now going back to the other one that is coding our meaning we have changed the size to 50 you can even make it bigger or smaller as you wish now let's program this first of all get our green flag and we need one sound also so that it looks good so first of all we'll do the easy part play the sound and so we'll select a sound from here so we can select any sound but the xylo sound is good enough So we'll select this. And we have selected this sound. We need to keep this in a forever block. So our sound part is done. Now coming to the main program. Again get a green flag to start with. And then when we are starting this, we want our minion to be in the original costume. So we want it to switch it to the first costume, minion 2. Then it should be in this costume and it should fall from any value between here and here. So let us check the values. What are they? Oh, at this boundary it is x minus 128 and x is 246 over here. We can even keep at a higher place. To for this is plus 246. Or we'll, we can keep it at minus 218 to plus 218, I guess. 
minus 218 to 239 and y value is 219 is good. So let us select that. For x value we have a good range. So let us give that minus 218 to 238 say and y can be 219 is good. So it should fall from any of these values from the top. And then I need a forever block for my loop. So it is falling down. What will what coordinate will change? The y coordinate. So my y value will change. I'll select this change y by y will decrease. So let it be minus 3. And y is decreasing and as soon as the video will be sensed so let me select an if block to check if the video is getting sensed and I have to put this block over here But for that, I need a comparison also because if block won't work without any comparison. So taking this if uh, comparison block and setting it over here, suppose I make it 10 so that it is easier for the detection thing. I have made it a small value. If the video motion on the sprite is greater than 10, then the costume should change. It should change to parachute. We want the next costume and then Y should increase, it should go upwards. So again selecting the same block, change Y by 5 suppose. But before that I should keep a repeat block so that this y value increases many times 10 times if it increases by 5 then it increases by 15 and so it goes up just on sensing once it goes up to a good height so our program for this is done so let's see how it's working Okay, uh, over here, uh, while it is falling down, we have just missed one costume change. After falling down, it changes to cost to the second costume. We should have easily selected this instead of this one. Next costume. Minion with parachute. And over here, it changes to the second costume. But after it goes to the top again and it's falling down, it should again change to its original costume that is the first one so we need to place that block also again over here so that when the value is decreasing it is in its original costume only which it was at the beginning so let's try this again
so we are done with this project and it's working as we had planned exactly thank you everyone